According to the doctrine of respondeat superior, employers are vicariously liable for employee torts occurring within the scope of employment. In Edgewater Motels Incorporated versus Gatsky, a seriously overworked employee saw his career go up in smoke. Arlen Gatsky, a district manager of Walgreen, supervised the opening of new Walgreens restaurants. Walgreen gave Gatsky the flexibility to make his own hours and complete his duties at any time and place, but required around-the-clock availability. In August of 1977, Gatsky traveled to work at a new restaurant in Duluth, Minnesota, where he stayed at the Edgewater Motel. At the end of a long week of on-site supervision, Gatsky got a drink at a bar near the Edgewater. Gatsky retired to his motel room and filled out an end-of-day expense form. As he completed the form, Gatsky smoked a cigarette. When he finished, Gatsky went to sleep but woke up to a raging fire. Although Gatsky escaped, the fire caused over $300,000 in damage to the motel. Edgewater filed a negligence suit against Gatsky, Walgreen, and others in a Minnesota trial court. A jury found that Gatsky was negligent for placing a lit cigarette in the wastebasket and that Edgewater was contributorily negligent for providing flammable wastebaskets. The jury also found that Walgreen was vicariously liable because Gatsky's act occurred within the scope of his employment. Walgreen then made a motion for a judgment notwithstanding the verdict, or JNOV, arguing that no reasonable jury could have found the company vicariously liable. The court granted the motion, and Edgewater appealed to the Minnesota Supreme Court.